Okay, so we have this one. Uganda declares Ebola outbreak after one person dies. Uganda declared an outbreak of Ebola after a case of the relatively rare Sudan strain was confirmed in the country. The World Health Organization said. The WHO Africa office said in a statement the case was confirmed after testing a sample from a 24-year-old man in the country's Mubende district. Uganda health authorities investigated six suspicious deaths in the district this month. The country's health ministry said the 24-year-old patient died after displaying symptoms. There are currently eight suspected cases who are receiving care in a health facility, WHO Africa said, adding that it is helping Uganda's health authorities with investigation and deploying staff to the affected area. This is the first time in more than a decade that Uganda is recording the Ebola Sudan strain. Dr. Machidi Moiti, WHO Regional Director for Africa said, We are working closely with the national health authorities to investigate the source of this outbreak. Uganda borders the Democratic Republic of the Congo, which is experiencing an Ebola resurgence following outbreaks this year. So news to China considers easing entry rules for some foreign tourists. The Chinese government issued draft regulation that aim to bolster tourism along its border and make it easier for some foreigners to enter China. According to a draft policy document released by China's Ministry of Culture and Tourism, tour groups organized by travel agencies in China's border areas will be able to choose their port of entry and exit. However, further details on locations and dates weren't provided. In recent weeks, the Chinese government has significantly tightened COVID restrictions to contain the spread of the highly transmissible Omicron variant. In September, multiple megacities were placed in full or partial lockdowns. Under the new draft policy, foreign tourists will be allowed to visit China's border tourism sites, but only as part of tour groups. The policy didn't specify whether those entering would still have to follow China's quarantine requirements for incoming travelers, which consists of one week of hotel quarantine and three days of home observation. China shares a border with 14 countries, including Russia, Mongolia, Vietnam, Laos, and Myanmar.